Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, today we're gonna do a chit chat get ready with me. I haven't filmed one of these in so long, so I'm kind of excited. I was gonna do a Tarte, like one brand get ready with me, but there's a few things, there's actually two things that I wanna get from Tarte for that video, so I think I'm gonna run out to Ulta later today and then I'll film that tomorrow. <clears throat> So for now, we're just going to do a little get ready with me. Nick has a basketball game today, so I'm not going to get like super glam, but I thought it would just be fun to sit here and chat with you guys because you guys have been requesting this video for a good long while. Okay, so let's just dive in. I probably should have gone over my face with Bioderma. Let's do that real quick. Okay, hopefully that's still in focus. I'm going to put some lip balm on. This is Fresh Sugar. My favorite. And then I just get two little um, cotton pads. These are the Shiseido Facial Cotton. Oh my God, they're the best. If you try these, you will never use another like cotton round ever. Should I just take that? Even though I washed my face this morning, I do this just to make sure there's like no oil or anything ugh, on my face, which there is. Okay, so I gotta let this dry for a minute. Hopefully I'm still in focus. Usually when I get up, maybe I should, let's refocus. Not like you guys care, but. I'm going to put some of my Roto Cool Eye Drops in because my eyes have been getting so red. And someone said to me that it might be from the Essence Mascaras, which if that's the case, I will be so sad because I love them. But it does seem like ever since I started using the two new Essence mascaras that I got, my eyes have been getting really red. Oh, so sad. So I'm not going to use Essence mascara today. I'm going to use the Catrice Glamandol, which is awesome. But I'm going to put some eye drops in just in case. Ah. So I'm going to start out with my Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Base, of course. I love this stuff. Mm, it smells so good. Sorry if my camera is like shaking. I got this new tripod. Well, I actually got two new tripods. But the one is one of those like bendy ones. And I like it, but it's not very stationary. Like if I move this table. Woo! See? It like goes everywhere, so I have to be careful. So I'm going to use my CoverGirl BB cream, and I'm just going to mix in a little tiny bit of my Smashbox Studio Skin in 2.2. That doesn't look too good. So I just, I'm just going to put it on the back of my hand. And one little pump. Just to add a little bit more coverage. Mm, look at that color. It's like the perfect shade. So what's up guys? Are you guys ready for Christmas? Christmas is what I said. I just put the beauty blender in my mouth pretty much. Um, I'm not ready. I always wait till like the 20th and then I just go crazy and like buy everything in like two days. I don't know why I do that, but I do it every year. A lot of you guys have tried this um, CoverGirl BB cream, and I love when you guys are like, oh my god, it's so good. How did I live without it? Like, that makes me so happy to hear. I freaking love it. Best BB cream I've ever, ever, ever used. It's so good. For concealer, I'm going to start with my Sephora Bright Future Corrector in Melon. So I'm going to take that right there. Some of these steps are repetitive, like I do them in every video, but I have to do them, so sorry. So I'm kind of like planning out my 2016 favorites. These are like my favorite videos to film. They're so long, but they're like so informative and I get to talk about like the best products of the year. So it's like so exciting. So I've been sitting down and like writing out what my favorites are. It's so hard though, because there were so many good products this year. I'm going to use my Naked Skin from Urban Decay. 
Um, there's like so many products that I want to talk about. So we're, oh, this is kind of looking dark. It's medium light neutral. Hmm. I might have to add in, I'm going to use my Wet n Wild highlighting pen. Oh, well shit, this ain't any brighter. Oh, Nicole. We're just going to make it work. Tony's upstairs on the phone fighting with Comcast because our internet freaking sucks. Like we pay so much a month for like high speed fancy internet and it's terrible. So they're going to have to fix it. Okay, so to set that I'm going to, I'm just going to use my crystal powder, but then I have a different powder to put on top. That sounds weird, but just, just stay with me. So I'm going to use my little Kat Von D 25 brush to set my under eyes. I love this brush. It's like a flat like paddle foundation brush, but it's still fluffy. It's really different and I love it. So yesterday on Snapchat, I was talking about like shows and movies that my kids watched when they were younger, like on repeat. And I was talking about, Caillou. I don't know where my camera stopped recording. I was talking about Caillou. Did your kids watch Caillou? He was such a little brat. Every time it would come on, me and Tony would be like, oh, hell no, our kids are not watching Caillou. So you guys sent me a ton of memes on Twitter yesterday. Like, there's so many memes out there about what an asshole Caillou is. So I'm like, okay, I'm not the only one, thank God. But, like, his mom needed to just whoop that ass. Such a little brat. But I'm like, why would you make a show where a kid is such a little asshole? Because then it, like, teaches the kids watching it, oh, I can be an asshole like Caillou. Right? Maybe I'm crazy. <laughs> Maybe. So I'm going to take this Laura Geller Filter Finish Setting Powder in Universal. Look how pretty it is. Can you see that? Um, it has just a little bit of, it kind of reminds me of the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Powders. So I'm just going to take a little bit, what's this? I'm just going to take a little bit of this and like just dust it. This could go tragically wrong, but it could be really good too. I'm going to use my Big Elf Powder Brush. I just want a little bit of like, just give me a little bit of life, okay? Just a little bit. Oh, ooh, it's really pretty. Ooh, I think I like this. Okay, so my brows are done. A little bit more lip balm and oh, look at this little thing it's so cute this is the man eater palette from Tarte it's just glorious I even did my nails to match it because I have mental issues and nothing better to do with my life I like this shade because it's like it's kind of a cooler toned brown. It's not super duper warm. It looks warm, but when you put it on, it's like a little bit cool toned. I kind of like it. Tony's so nice when he calls places. Like he never gets like flustered. <laughs> Me, I start out nice and then shit goes downhill real fast. And I'm like, listen, motherfucker. I'm going to go on with Foxy and put that all over my lid. I'm going to use my finger. Ooh. 
Ooh, girl, look at that. <gasps> so pretty. Damn, that's a good ass eyeshadow. Kind of impressed. Then I'm gonna take the shade Hypnotic. This is gorgeous, look at this color. It's really pretty. I may even take it up into the crease a little bit. Yes. Okay, I'm going to take Midnight, this dark brown, just to deepen things up a little bit. With, just put a little bit of this in the crease. And we'll blend that out then. Yep. Mm-hmm. I'm going to take a little bit of my RCMA powder right up here. Just to kind of clean everything up. In my waterline, I'm going to use Best O from ColourPop. Oh, girl, excuse me. Whatever. So, I, I mean, I don't know. But they're, they're not going to come out here, put holes in the walls, and, and fish freaking cat whatever cat five wires to the freaking line or the walls okay this is urban decay midnight cowboy and it's gorgeous i'm just gonna put it right here on my lower lash line just a little bit just a little tiny bit. These are so easy. You don't need any like primer, no base. You just put it on. Tony just texted me and said we have to leave in 15 minutes. <gasps> okay, I'm going to curl my lashes. Ah. We can do this, guys. We can do this. Okay, Catrice Glam and Doll Mascara. Oh my god, I'm in like crazy mode. Okay, I backed you guys up. So bronzer, I'm going to use my Makeup Forever Pro Bronze Fusion in 35i. And I'm going to use my beloved R2 from Morphe. Oh shoot, let me wipe away this. <laughs> that little bit of bake. Okay. This bronzer, I don't know. I feel like it doesn't show up that well on me. I'm going to go in with Girlactic Cabo just a little tiny bit. Just a little bit. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, for blush, I'm using my Marc Jacobs Kinks and Kisses. Kink and Kisses. She's so gorgeous. And this little brush from Japanesque. Mm. 
This might be my favorite blush of 2016. Spoiler alert. I think it is. You know my ass is still going to bake. RCMA No Color Powder. Beauty Blender. Okay, for highlighter, I'm using my Wet n Wild, what is this called? Boozy Brunch. This is amazing. If you don't have this, you need it. It's so good. And a Morphe M510. <laughs> 510. Look at that shit. Look how gorgeous. <gasps> yes, bitch. Yes, live my life. <sighs> what? Play my existence and I highlight my nose even though my nose is not super tiny I don't care oh I'm gonna put a little bit of this on my brows I mean on my brow bone Okay, for lips, I'm going to keep it simple for lips. I'm going to use NARS Get Dirty. This is really pretty. This is their, oh, it doesn't say, but it's like one of these little like lip creams almost. Okay, I'm going to wipe away the bake. Oh my god, I still have to put pants on. <laughs> I'm pantless. <gasps> oh, don't judge me. These lights get hot, so I like to film with no pants on, okay? It's not that big of a deal. Stop with your judgy eyes. little bit of setting spray and we'd be done yo everything's wet what the fuck okay you guys i gotta go tony's probably upstairs tapping his foot with this sour ass look on his face so i'm gonna head to nick's basketball game thank you guys so much for getting ready with me i love you guys so much and i will see you next time bye severe case of camel toe today that I don't even like it's become a daily thing like put your pants on put your shirt on oh camel toe she belongs if she's not there I start to worry I'm like where the f is my can oh I wanted to, I wasn't like I'm, I didn't wait what okay I think we're good I think we're good oh my god I think I just pulled a muzzle on my neck oh shoulder wait we ain't going nowhere that's why I highlight the fuck out of my shoulder